Right, hello people. So in this video today, we're going to be playing a small indie horror game called Missing Hiker by a game developer called GameZL. So go and check out on Steam. Link will be in the description to the Steam page. Enjoy the video. Have a laugh. Sadly, there is no camera because there was a bit of lag at the start. So I just thought we'll just turn off the camera so that it doesn't look like I'm just full of jank <laughs> because it was not good. Uh, but Enjoy it. Send some horror games down in the comments because 8 p.m. British Standard Times every Saturday I will be doing a horror game stream. So you're going to get more horror games here and you can go and get more horror games live there. So go and have a check out. Like, subscribe, comment and give me a follow on Twitch. Cheers for watching. Let's get into the video. Uh, yep, yeah, okay. Okay, welcome to The Missing Hiker. So, um, yeah, there'll probably be a little bit of a cut there, but um, this is making my eardrums rumble. Wow. <laughs> oh, God. Do some six words with this. Do a little bit of drifting. Oh, I crashed the car. Um... Come on, turn, turn, there we go. Look at that, I'm a natural already. What was that down there? Oh, it's a rock. <laughs> right, let's, let's get serious now. Let's, let's, um, let's drive. So our brother's gone missing. We're gonna go find him. Now the Red Mountains. Okay, got it. Oh, there's a car. <laughs> Is what you call a perfect drive. <laughs> Let's get back through the credits. Oh god. <laughs> oh. You see that that is how you drive professionally. Oh. <laughs> I should park at this gas station to ask if they saw my brother. Okay. Uh, just park next to a pump or is there a specific parking bay oh no there we go e to exit the car okay yes we parked up and uh let's have a look at the parking job uh, not bad it's a bit wonky just a bit <laughs> oh show off all right anyways this is a small store okay what do you want I'm searching for my brother. He went missing while hiking in this area. Sorry to offend you, pal, but that's not my problem. Also, you shouldn't just randomly approach people like this. Especially in this area. What do you mean? Hey, look, man. I worked pretty late. I just want to grab some snacks and beers and drive home. I'm not in the mood to talk with people. I don't know. I understand. Sorry for bothering you. I annoyed the business guy. Okay, let's have a look then. Ooh, we got some pistachios. We got vegan mayonnaise, uh, Nutella, mm, yummy. Uh, oh, I thought that was beans then, it's chickpeas. Ooh, nah, where's the beans? They gotta have beans here somewhere, come on. Losers, man, where's the beans? More chickpeas, tomatoes, nah, they ain't got beans, all right, nah, not a good shop. Anyways, what can I do for you, sir? I'm searching for my brother. He was hiking around this area. He should have come home yesterday. Have you seen him? How does your brother look like? He has brown hair and is pretty tall. 
He also has a green backpack. Uh, let me think for a second. Hmm, yeah, I think I saw your brother. He came in here and brought a few things, some water and a few snacks. You trying to find him? Have you told the police already? Yes, I did in fact, but they said they didn't have any resources for a search right now. They said they only start a search if the person is missing for more than 48 hours. Ah, it isn't the first time someone went missing in this area. At least a handful of people went missing there in the last decade. People talk a lot. I've just heard rumours that there are strange screams and weird noises coming from the woods. So, you should be careful, especially going there at this time of night. There's a road right behind the gas station leading to the mountain. Make sure to stay on it. There could be dangerous wildlife in that area. Thanks. I'll make sure to stay safe. Yes, we will. Take care. Okay. So. We're going into a dangerous set of woods to try and find our brother who's most likely dead from a wildlife accident. Oh, Mother Nature. How be you doing today? Okay, anyways, let's go and search. Okay, wait a second. Hello, can I have a torch or something, please? Like, free, please. I have a torch. Why didn't I know this before? Why didn't I know this before? I have one. There is another car here, okay. Now that I know I have a torch, now I can see where I'm going. Yeah, that's bloody hell. Oh my god, I am a bit dopey today. Okay, let's just, let's go. So, I'm guessing we're probably looking out for a camp. You never know, we might just be perched up somewhere, just camping out for the night. Might have wanted to have a bit of extra time away. I think it might have just been the first section that was just a really buggy part. I think the rest of this is fine now. Just it would have been really nice to know that I had a torch. <laughs> I mean, you usually just pick one up somewhere, but yeah, this one now nah, you just have to figure it out. I'll press F. Yeah, I guess it is normal though, F a flashlight. Oh. My brother's tent looks entirely different. I should still take a closer look. Um. Oh! Fucking hell. Oh. Oh. Oh my god. Oh. Okay. Ooh. 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 Whoa, whoa. Who the fuck are you? You scared the shit out of me. I scared you? I almost had a heart attack myself. Oh my god. <laughs> what do you want? I hope it's not some kind of pervert or creep. I'm not. I'm searching for my brother. He was hiking in this area. Have you seen him? Nope, I haven't seen him. Wait. You don't even know how he looks like? Look man, I'm just some guy that likes to hike in a woods and sleep in a tent in freezing conditions. I haven't seen anyone in days. I understand. You're planning to go deeper into the forest? Yes, I'll search around the area. I hope I can find my brother or at least find traces of him. Look, you'll probably think I'm a stoner or something, but last night I had my tent a bit up north. And I heard weird noises coming from the woods. It sounded like a child was crying, but I didn't see anything. It 
creep me out. Maybe it was a cryptid. A what? Look, man, you carry. What do you mean? I'm talking about a piece, you know? Something for protection. You mean a gun? No, I don't. You idiot! You're going out into the woods and you're not going to take some form of firearm whilst you're in America. Like, come on, man. Then you shouldn't be here in the first place. It's way too dangerous to go deeper into the forest at night. But I'm not going to stop you. I just want to sleep now. Also, one last thing. Don't creep up a tent in the woods at night ever again. I almost would have shot you. Well, I guess I, well, I, guess I glad you didn't. <laughs> I mean, yeah, I'm, I'm glad you didn't shot me. Thanks, mate. Me too. Good luck with the search. Um, can, can I have your firearm? Like, you just have it on my person so that I can be nice and protected and safe from the uh, boogeyman who's going to pick on my ass? I don't know. <laughs> Oh, I'm gonna get bummed. Okay. Me brother, where are you? I'm calling out to you. God, this is just... Proper retro. I mean, hey, at least there's a path. I mean... That's the best part about this. I've actually got a path to go through. I'm gonna die. Dun, dun, dun. Death is coming real soon. Oh, this is... This is going to be fun. It's very atmospheric, this game. That's what I'm finding out. It's very atmospheric. And very suspenseful. Now that I've had that first jump scare, I am just on the edge of my chair. Like, that genuinely got me. Like, damn. Like these steep inclines would get me. I'd have a heart attack walking up this hill. <laughs> Where are you? Brother. It's getting really cold. I should set up my tent on the left side of the road. Um... Yeah? What, like, right here? Oh, cool. My things are pretty numb. It's hard to build a tent. Okay. Build it, mate. Build it! <laughs> Please! And now it's time for Betty Bows. Oh. Oh, wait. This a scene. It's cold, but I'm falling asleep slowly. I think I heard someone scream. Not sure if that was real or imagined. Oh no, it's still gonna be dark outside, innit? Lucky you've just gone back to sleep until the morning. Need to check it. Could be my brother screaming for help. How are you gonna defend yourself? That where it means? No, I don't think it was. Wait a second. Where are the screams coming from? Oh, it's a skinwalker. It's a skinwalker. Pretending to be human. Okay, yeah, that's definitely where the lights are coming from.
yeah, just completely diverge off the path and go towards some random ass light and screaming in the middle of the woods. Yeah, what a good plan. Is this? Oh, look, it's the light in the woods. Let's go this way. Why was it flashing? I know it's called a flashlight, but come on, man. That's my brother's backpack. He must be here. Wait, the backpack is completely empty. Nothing in here. Oh, you're gonna walk into some random weirdo's house. Some just random ass house in the middle of the woods. You're just gonna walk in. Yeah, okay, let's just do it. This is not a place I want to be. Like you wouldn't be slightly concerned if you saw an axe and a bunch of hacking items to just mash someone up. Oh no. Oh no. Here we go. What the hell? Someone took a picture of my tent and my car. <laughs> Assholes. Your body was never found. Okay. Classic. Classic, classic, classic. That is absolutely just supreme peak horror. Yes, you walk into a small cramped space, you do every single cliche possible, and then you get hacked up and die. Peak performance. Absolutely brilliant. Right, I'm not gonna lie though, that was genuinely actually very good. The atmosphere was good, the jump scares, even though there were two of them, was really good. Uh, they actually got me. But fuck you, the developers! <laughs> um, and... Yeah, it's just, it was a good horror game. Um, I did get a little bit confused about the fact that I could press F for a flashlight, but I mean... Common mistake. <laughs> but, oh my god. Nice little jump scares. And then, just... Oh, it was filled with so many cliches, though. You're alone in the dark of night, in some random woods, you find a random house, and you hear some screaming, and of course you don't have a firearm, and then you go and just... Bleh. Dead. Just classic. Very classic, so, um, 